Hi friends, this is Laloon Bunny and I'm back for the fifth and final installment where I will swatch and explore the Wear and Go Alice in Wonderland Ink Collection. And now, it's Alice's turn. As usual, I'll be using the Sake Tomoe River 52 GSM Notebook. Working on these swatches, and this series of videos for this ink series, made me a little curious. Or as Alice would say, curiouser and curiouser about the source material. I remember watching the animated Disney film when I was a kid, but I haven't really thought much about it since then. And so, I bought a copy of the book some time ago. But I really haven't had the time to read it, and so I listened to the audiobook instead. And I loved it. It was funny and weird. It was often absurd. It had all these equally funny and weird and absurd characters that have become quite iconic through the years. I love that Alice is sweet and charming and smart. She questions the other characters innocently and yet incisively, which leads to funny interactions between them. The interactions between Alice and the Wonderland people led me to think that it's probably how a child, Alice is 7 years old, if I remember it right, would ask and inquire about what adults do. That what adults do and the reasons for what they do certain things are too weird for a kid. On a side note, this ink from wearing gold is icy blue with gold shimmer. And those colors echo the image of Alice we've seen in films and literature. She is usually pictured wearing a blue dress and has blonde hair. The ink series as a whole reflects or echoes the characters they named after. The Cheshire Cat ink is deep fuchsia, the Mad Hatter has notes of green, and so on and so forth.
that's it for this series. Thanks for tagging along as I swatch through these videos. I highly recommend these inks and the book too. So please check them all out. So to paraphrase from the book, we're all mad for journaling, fountain pens and inks here. I'm mad for them, you're mad for them. And you must be for your watching this video and follow the series. Have a creatively mad or madly creative day, friends. Till next time, this is Laloon Bunny. Bye!